Where are Any not? people? Oh, hon, you know, I was kind of here to talk about my Jesus problems. H. You know, hon, I was... Any people? Why the hell did I come back? Why don't you two just get a room of your own? Or would you rather me just hang out here in the hall and wait till you're done? Won't you come in, Roy? We was just talking about you. Wasn't we, Candy? Oh, yeah. Well... Did you do her? Do what? Did you and your hot tamale Puerto Rican dancing partner do it? For your information, she prefers to be called a lady of the night. I don't care what she prefers to be called! God damn it, Queen of Shiva, I don't fucking care that you do it! Oh, her. now you wait a minute! How dare you get your panties in a wad when it's the two of you that started this mess in the first place? I believe I'm just gonna go back over here to room for a while. I thought you said you couldn't stand being alone. Well, this ain't none of my business, really, you know? Oh, the hell it ain't. It became your business when she pissed on that stick and turned the damn thing blue. Okay. I'll stay, I'll sit over here in the chair, and y'all can just yell at me anytime you want to. Abuse me. <sighs> Roy. You have every reason to be mad at me. But did you have to go and find some Puerto Rican skank to get back at me? Lord knows what kind of diseases she might have, and now I'm gonna have them! Oh, oh, sweetheart, get back at you. I wasn't trying to get back at you. I wasn't even thinking of you. And do you have any idea how good that felt? How much does a girl like that run you, Roy? Well, I tried to leave. I'll tell you, she didn't cost me a damn dime. And you know why? Because she really liked me for me. She, she thought I was a real good guy, you know? And that I did not deserve a wife and a best friend to do me the way you two did. She thought that I deserved a hell of a lot more respect. And by God, she was right. Because I've had it up to here. I'm sick and tired of being treated like everybody's little punching bag. I know you know what I'm talking about, and I ain't gonna stand here and take it no more. As of right now, Roy Kirkendall is demanding your utmost respect, and he's gonna get it, or there's gonna be hell to pay, I promise you. I'm gonna kick some ass and take some names. I respect you, Roy. Darlene, I've been worried sick about you, honey. Oh, Don't come near God. me. God. You'll spoil my aura. Your what? Well, can't you see it? It's all around me. It's a big old cloud of self-esteem. And Tony Orlando gave it to me. <laughs> Dang, darling, you, she, you look, you look good enough to put in the J.C. Penny window. <laughs> well, thank you, Bubba. You met Tony Orlando? <laughs> no. But he sang right to me. 